Hello people of the internet. Look, I'm going to do it. I'm going to get a Christmas page coloured in July. This is the uh, Chibi Girls 100 pages and it's the four books in one. Chibi Girls 1, Chibi Girls 2, Chibi Horror and Chibi Christmas. And I am going to do it. Today is the 29th of July. And I'm going to do this and I'm going to upload it and I'm going to get a Christmas page in July and I'm going to use my just my normal alcohol markers and um, yeah sort of half colour and chat and whatever and it's the first time I've done a grayscale as well so dun 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 that's exciting isn't it this watch, book, this watch book just slid I had it standing up thinking it was going to work standing up but it really isn't going to work standing up right so I don't know if you have to do anything special with grayscale and if I cock this up I'm sorry I'm not a teacher I am a mucker about her <laughs> so what colour are we going to do the little girl little girl little boy not gender stereotyping but I'm just guessing um I think I'm going to do a uh, fruit pink there we go I've had to shut the window which is a shame because it's a lovely day today and there's nice air coming in but my next door neighbour is what sounds like hoovering their grass I think they're strimming it with a strimmer I have got my plastic sheet under here oh are you supposed to use darker colours on grey scale I haven't went back to work this week. Oh, that sounds crazy because obviously he already works. But he's been working from home since March 2020, like we all have. But his office has started going back and he has to go back one week in free. So two weeks he'll be at home, one week he'll be in the office. I don't know how long that will remain that way. Or whether he'll eventually go back full time who oh, no. knows oh, is that her arms or is that she's got short sleeves on and a bangle or has she got weird long sleeves on it's winter she's going to be wearing long sleeves surely don't know come back to it do the bits of flesh that you know are flesh like her hands. Oh, unless she's wearing gloves. Are, you, are they gloves? Are they short sleeves and gloves? Well, that would make more sense. I'm going to go for a bangle because I've already started colouring it. So then that's naked arm. We're going for naked arm and bangle. Naked arm and bangle. Naked arm. She must have been close, look, because she's got another bangle on this arm. And also her skin looks really puffy. <laughs> Poor girl. Right, ear roll. Around her lovely pearly earrings. Head. 
All of that is all right. Go fast on their face so you don't get lines. Pens really sound rough on this paper. I forget how rough the jade summer paper is. That's going to be a line unless I do something with that. And so is that. Let's go round. And let's go round. Keep going, keep going, don't stop. Don't stop. Keep going, run, 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 run. But she still gets lines on her face anyway. Perhaps I should use the chisel for big bits, but I keep panicking when I use the chisel. I get panicking when I go fast. I like going slow and enjoying it. That's why when I've got big expanses, I'm like. <laughs> It's not the right word. Not exactly. I've been out of an aeroplane here, am I? I'm coming, coming a chibi girl's face. Okay, and that's a rubber ear, oh, is it? I think so. That's a rubber ear inside. Okay, I think we did it. I think we did it. We have no streaks. Woo! Go me! actually came out really nice quite like that right uh, what color am i going to do her dress it's winter so i'm guessing she's got a pair of really red shiny shoes on like bright red shiny shoes so i'm going to use number 11 you know like them shoes that we all had when we was kids and i think she's probably got a red dress on as well because it's christmas and everyone wears red dresses at Christmas. Someone tell me if it's supposed to do something different on grayscale, like shade the grey bits, or is it just all done for you? Leave the highlights. Got too gung ho, didn't I, up there with the old face? I thought there was an edge here. Is it how much I turn the uh, the book around? <laughs> Lovely stuff. The bow is definitely going to be red. Anyone who pre pre I know some people pre plan they get all their colours out in a heart in advance. I'm just like, nah, just go for it. Why do I always want to sing? So what colour her dress is going to be come back to her dress because is it going to be a Christmas dress now he's going to be wearing blue denim jeans and it's winter so they're going to be dark denim so I'm going to go for new Neapolitan blue oh can't get the lid off did I start recording yeah Whenever over his jumper a bit, I guess his jumper's going to be blue now as well. <laughs> Maybe he should have done his jeans a little bit lighter. 
looks like he's got 40 year old stay presses on now rather than cool hip hip dude denim maybe she doesn't want a cool hip dude though maybe she wants a man who wears stay press blue trousers from Marks and Spencer I've been very quiet with my husband back at work. I have no one to talk to. Which is, I guess I say, both a blessing and a curse. It's quite nice, but it is also it's quite lonely. Yeah, it's just going back to how we used to have it, where we both worked. Uh, we say goodbye to each other at 7 o'clock in the morning and then sorry each other again at half past 6 at night. <laughs> okay, that's his jeans done, or his blue stay presses. So, he's going to be wearing, now he's got, this is one of them, no, that's his shirt underneath there. So this is all jumper. He just happens to have, um weird edging so the weird edging I'm going to do a dark Prussian blue green blue or Prussian blue I'm going to do it Prussian blue actually no if I do it a greeny colour then I can make his jumper a bit greenier now I'm going to do his jumper like sky no he shouldn't be wearing sky blue anyway he should be wearing green it's Christmas White puffy sleeves on as well, aren't they? How's she going out with this fella with his stay press and puffy sleeves? Prussian blue it is. Let's not make too much of a uh, song and dance about it. Or Russian blue, as it says on my cheap pens. Sorry, I moved it nearer to me. This isn't very Christmassy, this one. But it, it has got a Christmas tree and um, that stuff that you kiss under, mistletoe. I was going to say the duvet then. Forget how absorbent this paper is. quite nice with a blue edge. So his jumper's got 1980s Michael Jackson type piping, like in Frida. I've got my glasses on, that's why I can't see properly. And I'm quite close, not too close to the paper. Oh, is that his backpack? Have you got a backpack on? Is that what them things are? Oh well. He has got a backpack, I can't see it. There's such a lot of guesswork in some of these pictures, isn't there? Is that dress? Is that arm? Is that backpack? Is that Michael Jackson type jumper? Okay. Let us do his... Um, jumper jumper nice light blue phalo blue I do like a bit of phalo blue oh that's green 183 phalo blue it doesn't matter if it's a backpack or not Ooh, these books are quite unwieldy, these big books. Look. Oh, big ups there. Went right over. Sorry, I'm going in. Wasn't concentrating at all. I 
I was just thinking how unwieldy these books are. And as much as they're quite reasonable for the big books compared to four of the little books, I think I prefer the little books because these feel unwieldy. The pattern of the squares underneath coming through. Not sure. Is my head now in the way? Sorry. Oh no, I've just realised this is a big bit. I've got to move fast. Maybe I'll use the chisel. Let's go chisel. Let's go ham. By the way, I've no idea what go ham means. Go all out. Chisel. Chisel me chisel. No idea what that means either. Oh, look at it pouring down. Oh, I'm scared. Oh, look at it. It's like, oh, I don't like it. There's like puddles of ink. Sorry, I felt my head at the camera. It was, it was too fast for me. It was too much. Too much ink coming out at once. Sorry, that was probably my, all my head. I don't know how that's going to come out because that's the amount of ink that came out of that. I've got his little neck bit on his jumper. Let's go back to the. Should I do the Russian blue? Yeah. Because he's just he's Mr. Stay Press. He's, if it is his backpack, matches his edge of his jumper. Coordinated like that. That's why she likes him. He might not be the most youngest, hippest dude, but he's coordinated. And we're going to give him brown shoes because everyone knows what colour shoes do you wear with uh, blue trousers. That's right, you wear brown shoes. Oh, they're trainers. Oh, you can't wear trainers. He's not wearing trainers. They look like um, they've got the white bit and the whatever colour bit there I don't care, he's having brown ones he's very British, he's wearing brown shoes he's not a sneaker boy and when he's at his foot all the way to there yeah. I might give him brogues because they've got a different front bit to back bit I need my glasses off and the head's going to get in the way now because it's a tiny bit here Because he's a 19, he's a 40 year old man in a 10 year old man's body, he's going to have brogues. So the front toe bit is going to be a little bit darker, lighter orange, orange, lighter brown, like a pair of brogues. You got these from Marks and Spencers as well. Actually, them brands didn't actually come out much different, so that really wasn't worth the uh, the effort. Right, let's make his uh, 
I've got to do both the bottom of their shoes. So let's do her bottom of the shoes a darker red colour. Because he's asked her out on a date for Christmas. She's dressed up all Christmassy and he's just turned up in sneakers, jeans, with a backpack on. But he has bought a bunch of flowers. What colour am I doing the bottom of his shoes? Um, dark, dark brown. There's the chocolate brown. Oh. <laughs> this one. Oop. There's something in front of my, uh, that's why I keep moving it. Let me just move it. Let's move that. So that's better. I can get all my pens out now. They was uh, getting caught on something. Right, so he looks all right. Maybe I should do his, give his shirt a little bit of colour. Pale baby blue. Would he really be? Or oh, mint blue. Mint blue's really light. One, four, three. Or light blue, 271, let's do that. So it's just a hint. 271. Is it 271? What am I looking for there? 182 is what I'm looking for. Frost blue. Because he definitely, when he got up in the morning, decided he was going to wear all blue. Apart from his underpants. Actually, this blue is so light, it just looks grey because the grey underneath. Lovely. Right. What? Now, what does do hair? What colour hair is she going to have? I should do her dress first, really. What colour hair is she going to have? She's going to have a red headband, so let's put her, do her red headband because obviously she's a cold, naked young lady as well. Oh, we had terrible rains the other day. So close to being flooded, it was unheard of scary. There was, um, imagine an old London street where there's just a terrace houses. And then imagine a gap between, so a row of terrace houses, gap, row of terrace houses. Our house is built in the gap. And so the rain water, it rained really quickly and really hard and the rain had nowhere to go because the drains sort of over, got overwhelmed. And because it can't get behind the houses because they're just all in the terrace, our gap became the sort of escape route for all the water. So there's, there's the road and then the water, we looked out the front door and the water would come, it was pouring from this way down the driveway and this way down the drive. Now we have a we are detached, so we've got space at the back for the side for the water to go down. And the water was just like rushing down the side of our house. It was like a literally river by the side of our house. And I um, should do the roses the same colour, but I'll come back to them. And um, it was, that's our door, front door. <laughs> and that was the rain. And it was getting nearer and ne nearer and nearer and nearer. And it got to there and literally we could just put our foot out and was in four inches of water um, and then literally it stopped raining and it just dissipated and it literally missed coming into our house by a centimetre but the conservatory leaked which is a whole different thing so while we was going oh, we're not going to die the water's not coming in the front 
it was pouring through the conservatory roof. Fabulous. Right. Right, what colour am I doing her hair? I should really think what colour I'm doing her dress. I want to do her dress red, but maybe it'll be too red then. Let's do everything else and come back to her red dress. I'm going to do the tree, the Christmas tree, and the mistletoe. And I'm going to use forest green for the tree. But yeah, so we had enormously hot, boiling, sunny weather where we were all sweating like 30 degrees unheard of, followed by terrible, terrible rain where we nearly got flooded. I think the screen's a bit dark. Stop losing the definition of the tree. Maybe I'll do this under layer dark. Why is that big over top? Oh, snow. If I do it as tint on my face, I'll do that under layer dark. And then I'm going to go up a notch. I'm going to go <laughs> up to Beridian. That's any better or not, I don't know. It's still very dark. Maybe I'll do the next layer up on one as well. I feel like I have my perfect setup now with my uh, alcohol markers. Yes, I think I'm going to go one up again. 54, that was. 54, Viridian. Let's have a look. Hmm. Turquoise green light. It sounds a bit of a weird colour, but... Oops. Not the chisel, I'm scared of the chisel. They all look the same on here. But that is a nicer green. I think the black paper of the Jade Summer books takes all the colours down a, a shade, doesn't it? Is that? I've got to get close, sorry. Got to take my eyeballs off and get close. I can't see whether that's tree. Which it is. I know you're up there. I know you can see my head. I'm sorry. I can feel the camera. I'm not so great at colouring chests. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> because... I have to get really close, I'm short sighted. You're even going to see that with this ginormous fat book that I can't fit on this. a bit of cream. That's a bit of tree. Oh, what is that though? Is that a bit of branch? Is that supposed to be branch? 
and then that's tree. It looks like it is, you know, it's a weird sticky tree. Concentration. Guys, <laughs> we're up right near me now. Sorry, probably can see my head. I don't know why people do it about putting their head in. I'm guessing because people with normal eyes don't have to get so close. I've always had bad eyes, it's not an age thing. When I was a kid I couldn't couldn't see the board at school, you know. I can't because this book's so thick. I'm having to hold it up there to get this near enough. Um yeah I couldn't read the blackboard and uh, I used to have to stand right next to it to read it. And it was eventually they sent me to have my eyes tested and I got glasses age seven. The really wonderful, you know, the NHS pink framed glasses of the 70s. Anyone in America is probably thinking, what's NHS pink frame glasses of the 70s? Ouch, sorry. When I edit this, if I edit this, I'll pop picture in. That's stick, isn't it? That bit there is definitely stick. Because a leaf wouldn't do that. Glasses, to look at my pens. Yeah. Stick. Uh, what colour do we want stick? Mahogany. That's the one I was going for. No, that says chocolate. What number is mahogany? 96. But there were some other bits there that were supposed to be stick, but they're free now. Looks weird having a bit of stick in the middle of it. Great. Let us do. Mm, let us do. We got this is snow, isn't it? And that's some weird tree thing because it's got sticks on it. So let's do that mahogany. Or bushes, they're bushes. Have some tight these lids. Sorry, I'm going in. And going in. Just see if we can have a clue on the front. What? Because obviously, I suppose if, you, if you're into chibiness, you'll know what these are. Kind of things. Right, let's make them plants green, but a different green. I want to make them more of a more of a number forty-two.
It's the only way I think that these are plants is because they've got them sticks sticking out of them. Otherwise I'd have just thought there was bits of snow in the background. There might still be. I've got used to using my um, skinny markers, so these feel really um, juicy. And scarily fat. Oh, I quite like that green. I like that green better than that green. So we'll do the leaves. If I, can, I was going to say, oh, should I do a bit of shading? Oh, Grayscale's already shaded, isn't it? That's a rose, that's a leaf, that's a leaf. That's a leaf. That's a leaf. There's another one there. Is there? Is there? Yes. I don't suppose it really matters because it's just like a bundle of stuff you can't really see. Sorry, that was probably all head for you, wasn't it? Right. I decided that I think I'm going to make him a flame haired ginger boy. Let's do this first of all. I want to do this like paper baggy colour. 97. Hopefully this won't be too brown. Just hope you bought them from a shop and didn't steal them from someone's front garden. My mum's birthday next week I means she's getting all her goodies. I was sorting them out yesterday. Yes. Oh, is that a bit of leaf there? And well, that'll be a bit of the petal. Okay, so he's got his paper bag in his hand and his roses. So we need to do the mistletoe. There's a bit of a branch up there of a tree, so let's do that. Same colour, mahogany. I keep forgetting that these are more juicier. You've got to stay away from the edge. Oh, look at that. Look how awful I am. Look. 
Zoom them off. Does it mean that my head's not quite causing you so much grief? Awfully there. This is a really juicy pen. Oh, remember not to go near the edge. It's bleeding awfully. Decided on her dress yet? Could do it bright yellow. It's not very Christmassy though, is it? Especially if she's going to have yellow hair, blonde hair. Mm. Let's do his face. Now, what colour is he going to be? I want him to have ginger hair. Ed Sheeran like. Maybe I'll make him putty coloured. <laughs> One six nine. Oh, that may be a bit light. Oh. Let's do it on his hand first of all. Oh, it's definitely a little bit light. Gotta keep remembering that. Colours drop down a notch. Let's get his ear rolls done. Can you even see his ear rolls? Yes, you can. Kind of looks like he's got jaundice. Poor lad. He's probably been in the hospital, just coming out, going on a date. She feels sorry for him. Been in the hospital for since he was born. He was born with jaundice. Make a wish foundation. Said, "What would you like to do?" And he said, "I want to go out with Susie. I buy a bunch of red roses. I wanted to wear a pretty red dress, red shiny shoes. That's my wish." She said, I don't want to go out with a yellow boy. He said, look, he's got his dad's day presses on. Make an effort. Be nice. Reminds me of years ago. I used to live with... God, this is an awful colour. I used to live with a guy. Well, it's probably not an awful colour for a putty, but it's not a great colour for skin. I used to go out with a guy. I didn't go out with a guy. I lived with a guy. Right. I used to rent a house. Okay. And I rented the whole house and I used to rent out. It had four bedrooms. I would rent out three of the bedrooms. And the rent that I took on three of the bedrooms paid for the entire rent of the whole house. So I used to live for free. And it was all people that I worked with, the company that I worked with, so it was all, we all knew each other, that's pretty good. And there was one guy who moved in because his wife chucked him out, so he was single. And he was older, I mean I was then, I was 21 and he was 40. And um, he started, he wanted to go to a singles club thing, 
Over 21 single club then. Oh. oh no! I can't stop, he's gonna get lines on his... That was my husband, saying he's on the way home. And I said, I can't stop. Did I hang up? Nope. Forgot to hang up. He was, uh, I can't stop, I'm covering with the boy's face. He's got jaundice, he's got out for a date. And he was like, what are you even talking about? Okay, if you think that this colour looks horrible on camera, Oh, it's all got lines all over it now. What colour can, can I put on him to make him look a little bit less jaundiced? I should use my... I've got a swatch of these pens. Look at him. State of him. His skin's a mess. Looks great. <laughs> he looks green in camera. Looks green around the gills. Maybe I'll go over with a different colour. This is where maybe I'll go over with powder pink and see what that does to him. Let's do his hand first. He's clearly got a yellow undertone to his skin. Let's see how that dries down, that hand. Oh God, it looks green. Oh no, I don't know, it's going a sort of beigey colour. It's not too bad, it looks green on camera though. What is it that you put on green when you have makeup? You put, is it red? Maybe I need a brighter pink to put on it and then he'll, he won't look yellow. I mean, she looks happy to see him. 